Hello, my name is Roger Soares with Archbase Corp here in Japan, and today we're excited to be able to introduce to you this bakery behind me. Um, this bakery actually is over 50 years old. The actual building itself um, belonged to the, uh, the owner's grandparents, and uh, this building they're now they've now turned it into a bakery. Um, one of the nice things in Japan is that a lot of machia. Um, Japanese traditional townhouses and old buildings like this, they are now changing and preserving into bakeries and small shops. So this is a bakery and we're lucky today to have Hiro with us. And um, hi Hiro. Hi. Ah, hi. So what we call, what's called in Japan yakisugi, in the US is called shosugiban. And it's basically it's the pre-treatment, fire pre-treatment of wood. and um, you can see here, each of these panels here, what they've actually done here is they've, before these are put on, this, on the surface like this, on the exterior, they actually um, burn with a burner. They slow burn just the surface of each one of these panels before they're actually putting up here on the, um, on the exterior surface. But um, let's ask Kiro, so basically, here to explain, there's three reasons why they do this. Um, first, it's a natural treatment for um, to prevent termites, but also it's it also helps the wood to become waterproof and also fireproof. So this is these are the three main reasons: uh, prevent termites from getting into these boards and waterproof. Proofing and also fireproofing for the exterior like this. Um, um, so here's a saying that these this siding here will last typically between 30 and 40 years. Um, uh, if you wanted to put some paint, or you wanted to um, stain the wood, you have that option, but it's not necessary. So, one interesting point here we want to we want to point out was you can see here in this yakisugi here, and as we go up here, you can see that the color is changing, and so here they've actually used stain. So that's what why the color is like this. You can see on the door here as well. So this is probably originally using yakisugi, this fire treated wood, um, but then they've actually Later on, they've probably added some stain on this. So. Okay, so today we were really happy to be able to have the opportunity to share with you this uh, old this old bakery. Uh, this building again is uh, over 50 years old, and uh, we we're happy to be able to talk to you and share with you this yakisugi. Um, yakisugi actually the history um, goes back to the Edo period. So this is roughly uh, 1603 was the beginning of the Edo period in Japan. So this dates back several hundred years, this kind of technique of treating wood. Um, a few decades ago, this treatment of wood was seen as being a cheap way of treating wood. And today, um, again, this is becoming more popular. So this is, getting, this is actually becoming more popular, and we're happy to see it because it's, uh, it's a natural way to, to treat wood. So thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you next time. Thank you. OK, so thank you for watching this video today. We hope you enjoy it. If you like this video, please check out our YouTube channel and subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Bye.